Now I'm going to teach you how to make sauce. This is a uh, Korean gochujang and it's made with uh, sun-dried uh, red chili flake and it's red chili paste. Now what you're going to be doing is you're going to be mixing it. This is probably a tablespoon. So, me, I'm going to make a lot. For you guys, uh, I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> I'm making for six people, five people. So I got about four tablespoons. I think it looks almost like a cup. Uh, sesame seed, roasted sesame seed to your taste. You don't want to put them in, don't put them in. You want to put them in, put them in. I'm putting about a tablespoon. I have a corn syrup here. That's what I'll be using. Sesame oil, I got a lot of sesame oil and everywhere else. But actually the bibimbap is all about sesame oil. That's what you're tasting. So I got about two tablespoons in there, okay? You could add more if you want to. Uh, corn syrup. Now if you, I have about a cup, then I would do another cup of corn syrup. So, this is to your taste. If you like it sweet, if it's not sweet enough for you, make it sweeter. And then you just stir. Now the reason why, uh, you could just eat bibimbap with gochujang on the side and mix it all together. But the, it's too hard, it's so hard. See, it's like, see? You want to make it a little softer. So when you go to the restaurant, I think some people add soy sauce to this. I don't like to add soy sauce in mine. I just want to do uh, with the corn syrup. So it makes it soft. The texture gets a little loose. So, and you know what? This is going to be your dipping sauce for Korean salad. Vegetables. You could use this to eat cucumber. Any vegetable. And see how it's more easy to maneuver? See, now it's not that big that, you know. How do you say, Sophie? More thick? I made it thinner, right? Yeah, see how it's, it's, it's more creamy and it's, cr it's flowing more. Now all we have to do is taste. So glossy. Mm-hmm. And look how beautiful the color. So glossy, shiny. Now it's sweet. So, mine's a little bit sweet on this one. You could add more if you want to. You don't have to add more if you don't want to. A lot of my vegetable already has enough salt. So, I'm going to add just a little bit more and make it a little bit sweeter. Now, because it's a corn syrup, it's not as sweet. It's not really sweet like sugar. But what it does is it's just giving that gloss. And the softer consistency that I'm looking for. Instead of using the... Um, Soy sauce. Okay. And it's done. This will be your vegetable dipping sauce. So, dipping pop sauce, also Korean vegetable dipping sauce. Tastes really good. And it doesn't get spoiled. This lasts in the refrigerator for a very long time. <laughs>